A video broadcast by China's official state media recently showed the H-6 Kelvin's heavy missile carrier's future crude uncrewed teaming and swarming capabilities. An H-6 Kelvin's bomber is seen launching four LJ-1 drones, which are then connected in a diamond pattern. The computer-generated animation also illustrates the capabilities that the PLA plans to acquire for its bombers. The LJ-1 was planned to be used as an aerial target or for other training missions. Although the latest video implies it might be used as a tactical unmanned air vehicle that is less expensive and could support manned military aircraft. The H-6 Kelvin's bomber aircraft is manufactured by China's Xi'an Aircraft Corporation XAC. It is a modified, long-range version of the Soviet Tu-16 Badger medium bomber from the 1950s. It is also regarded as the only mass-produced bomber in existence. The LJ-1 drone first appeared at the MOX 2019 air show, Russia's biggest air show. At the time, China's state-owned media, Global Times, claimed that the drone could sometimes replicate third, fourth, or even fifth-generation fighter jets. The drone has an estimated length of about 15 and a half feet and a wingspan of slightly over 8 feet. According to Aviation Week, the LJ-1 can perform tactical, operational tasks. In addition, the Chinese developers previously claimed that the LJ-1 might serve as a standoff ground assault missile or a radar jammer. The LJ-1 can be outfitted with systems that augment its radar and infrared signatures. Nevertheless, it is widely known that Beijing intends to integrate its stealth J-20 fighter plane with unmanned drones. The H-6 Kelvins, a large missile carrier aircraft, might be able to send LJ-1 drones off closer to the operation zone. This would enable the drones to either advance farther into enemy territory or stay in place for longer to conduct various duties. Additionally, the drone might be able to take off from various ships or tiny islands, which would, in some instances, allow it to begin its mission closer to its target location. It is unknown when and how the PLA will eventually deploy the LJ-1 and the related crewed-uncrewed teaming capabilities. Thank <music> you.